So in this video, I'm going to teach you how to plot road alignment using AutoCAD and SWTTM. So for this, you need to have five sets of data as shown here. The first one is serial number. Second is easting that is in X direction, north in Y direction and RL or elevation in Z direction and remarks of that particular data. Here now you open AutoCAD and make sure you open AutoCAD before you open SWDTM because it is so error if you open SWDTM before AutoCAD as uh, AutoCAD is busy or AutoCAD is not open yet so you have to open AutoCAD first. Very next step is to copy is to copy this data using this point option over in SWDTM window and import points from Excel so click in this point level scale this is used to increase the size of the letter and use remark as layer name if you want to use this remark as the name layer name so just I will do import points but we see that the points are not here so for this what I have to do is double click the scroll button of the mouse so for this I get the points over here so this is the intersection points of the road alignment so now using PL command that is polyline or you can also find it over here polyline I am going to draw a line joining all these major sorry intersection point and make sure that the object snap mode is on for making easier so this rectangular shape will come if OS snap mode is on here it is the OS snap object snap so this is the very first step I have done the second step I do here is go to the SWTTM window and in alignment I go for interactive alignment a new window is open and there is an option of select I go for select inter initial IP that is zero okay initial chain is zero okay so you have to select the object this is the object so I'm going to select this yes just press s okay so now zoom in that is this is the starting of the road alignment that is the radius will be zero so I will not change the radius over here press this button next uh, IP number one so it comes over here but it has some radius it will surely have radius because it is a core portion so I have the data for this that is the radius is 25 15 18 16 20 0 15 0 40 so I will enter the radius suppose it is 18 okay so a horizontal curve is set this is the MC point EC, BC point here will be MC and this is BC then go to the next point it will have a different radius for example it is 16 okay then I will go for the next point and let the radius be 20 similarly I will go for the next point and suppose the radius is 25 process this is a straight portion so it don't have any radius 7 it will have a radius I'm inserting the radius in random way 8 is also a straight portion so it don't have any radius 9 is a little bit curved so it will have a radius of very high radius maximum value of radius uh, and finally it is the end of the road alignment so it don't have any radius if you want to insert the width set width for example the width for now I keep is 7.5 meter tick this button and you will see the width of the road is shown similarly if you want to go with the chain is set chain is interval as a 20 meter chain is and the alignment is now obtained so IP not here we see a curve similarly here also we get a curve 
now this is the way how we draw the road alignment if you want to insert the detailing of this section just we need the coordinates of the detailing so this is the coordinate of detailing I will select all this and same process import points from Excel and we see the data has been plotted here so this is the way how we plot road alignment